Ever wonder why wolves are so scarce in North America today? Let's dive into a 400-year tale of survival and struggle. Back in the 1600s, European settlers arrived and found wolves everywhere. They saw them as threats to livestock and livelihoods. So they began hunting them, with bounties encouraging people to kill as many as possible. Fast forward to the 1800s and things got even worse. With the spread of ranching and farming, wolves were poisoned, trapped, and shot on sight. By the early 1900s, wolves were nearly extinct in the lower 48 states. But the story doesn't end there. In the 1970s, the Endangered Species Act brought hope. Wolves were given protection, and reintroduction programs helped their numbers bounce back in places like Yellowstone. However, the debate over wolves continues. Some see them as majestic creatures deserving protection, while others worry about their impact on livestock and game populations. Today, wolves are slowly making a comeback, but their future remains uncertain. One thing is clear though, the relationship between humans and wolves has been complex and ever-changing. So next time you see a wolf, remember, their story is one of resilience and survival. And it's still being written, ma.